This is a Brachypelma vagans, the Mexican gold red rump, I think. He's a good eater. <laughs> I'm going to offer her one more, and she'll probably take it. Yep. Good job. This is a Brachypelma albopelosum, the Honduras curly leg or curly hair. She's a beautiful lady. Just gonna offer her one. Good job. Brocky Palma Foamy. This one prefers crickets. I'll put a second one in there, but uh If I can coax it forward, she'll grab it. She loves crickets. There he comes. Girl. This is um, a pink zebra beauty E. campus striatus, I believe. Hmm. Nope, she did want it. Good girl. This is Brachypalma auratum, the Mexican flame knee. Usually a great eater. Um, let's have a look at her. I'm going to go ahead and offer her one more. She'll probably accept it. Maybe not. Maybe she just wants the one. I'll take that out. Good girl. There's my Jew Polka trying to make a break for it. Come on. Come on. Up or down. There you go. Go back down. Now, most of the time she'll take a super worm. So let's see what today's temperament is going to be. I think she's in hungry mode. I'll offer her a second. Yeah, I'm feeling she wanted more than one. Good girl. This is a juvenile brachypelma. Amelia, usually very nice eater. Today is no exception. Good girl. This is a juvenile Brachypelma classy. Great eater. 
Right now it doesn't look a lot different than the Bomi. But I bought it from a reputable guy as a sling for a great price. So you, <laughs> whichever one, it's awesome, but uh, I believe it is the classy. And uh, really happy to have one of these rare girls. Hope it's a girl. To be honest, I don't even like opening the top of this container. This is uh, the layer of my OBT, which I assume it's alive. I haven't seen it in about six months or so, but judging from the webbing. Oh, there's a light coming out on the left near the dark part of the... I think we might see an appearance. She's definitely... here she comes. Okay, guess she's still alive. Good job. All right, this guy is very hungry. I can tell by the way he's spasming around his cage, and I'm actually going to give him a super worm. Watch this. <laughs> oh, yeah. Baby's happy with that meal. This is an Acanthoscoria Brocklehursty. This one here is an Afnipalma Rio Grande Gold. I forget the exact name. Yep, I figured he was going to take that. This is a juvenile. Cute little sucker, isn't she? This is another juvenile, same uh, Afnipelma uh, Moderatum, the Rio Grande Gold. Oh! Either I startled her. I think I startled her. She's interested. Look at that. I don't think she wants a cricket though, or a super worm though. Well, she's got it now. Some tarantulas can be fussy, so I'm going to try a cricket. See if I get a different response from a cricket. Smart cricket. All right. We'll get him later. This is a Paraphysa scrofa, the Chilean copper. Yeah, she wanted that. This is my other G Pulcra, slightly smaller and unsexed. Knows exactly what the lid coming off means. Usually is a great eater for me. He does use a McDonald's apple pie box, by the way, as a hide. No problem. Hmm. 
wants to play with it first. How cute. I've seen them do this before. <laughs> Uh-oh. I wonder if he would rather have a nice fat cricket. Uh-oh. Okay, I guess not. Okay, now at some point, I had a C. fasciatum in here. Are we still alive? Very skinny, but still alive. Oh, there's a bolt. Which means I'm going to take, well, I would take the worm out, but a little point at this moment. Put this thing back there. Well, the worm's still up, so yeah, I'm gonna take it out. Put some water in here. Okay, and what we have here is a juvenile uh, the elbow pelosum. Usually a very good eater. Go have a closer look. Look at those curly legs. Is that not adorable? This is one of my favorite tarantulas, the Euaphilus species red. It only eats once or twice a year. So this is a common occurrence here where she refuses food. I call her my little Buddha tarantula because <laughs> she's just so chillax. I would be shocked to see her eat. Let's see, she's just not at all intrigued. I'm going to show you how docile this chick is. Look. Mm. Just incredibly chill. She's not tensing up at all on me. Just doesn't even care. If you're ever going to handle a spider, this is the one I recommend. This is my Salmopoas cambridgei. No clue if it's female or male, but it is a great, great eater. I suspect this one's female. There you go. Did you even get that second one? It's getting away. Go get it. Yeah, she's a good hunter. <laughs> Isn't she lovely? I'm guessing she's five inches maybe. She would like to know what sex she is, but I'm not about to pick her up to find out. <laughs> this is my crazy little brachypelma. All the steps. I say crazy. 
because she's quite the character. Now, get out of Cricket, and I'm, she's got a, sorry. Check this out. <laughs> Even as fat as she is, down it went. Such a sweetheart. That's why I only gave her one cricket because she's huge. She's surely going to molt soon. <laughs> 